remember the way back to the Black Breath. Of course. We need to walk across the bridge to the Vanaheim Tower. Are we going to the Black Breath? Or exploring? Your choice. We rode past that statue of Thor earlier, when we left the witch's camp. And what direction is that? It's mid-morning, the sun is over there, so... That's south. Southwest? Good. Enemies down. Oh look, the witch's magic is still covering those scorn poles. Saves us some time. Poor Fafnir. There's a fine line between ambition and greed, you know. Be careful where you're going. There's nobody nice out here anymore since all the people left. I mean, I hate to generalize, but um, mostly they just try to kill you. Good tip. Um, I know it's not my business, but if I were you, I'd wash off that symbol painted on your neck. We were told it would help protect us. Was that a lie? Oh, 
No, it's a protection stave, all right, but you can't render that pigment into paintable texture without blending it with boar urine. And is that really better than death? Maybe a little. Well, well, it's your neck. <laughs> Sindri, have you always been so... Clean? Huh, don't I wish. No, I was just as unsanitary as the next dwarf until the day a Vanir witch set me straight. She discovered with her magic there are hundreds of thousands of tiny beasties on everything around us. Oh, so small you can't even see them. No. It's true. And if they get inside you, they make you sick. But the witch told me there's one wood, the oak, that's a natural deterrent. Stops the beasties from spreading. So now, I make all my handles from oak. See? I think of these things. Okay, back to work. Sindri's Skyway card is still down there, if you don't feel like climbing. No roots. Guess the witch never came this way. Atreus, to me. We'll need something to get through this one.
Father, do you... do you think I could carry her now? No. But I... I said no. Okay. So who do you think carved the face in the mountain? You would know better than I. Thanks. Now watch your step. Carelessness will only delay us. Right. Well, there's the black breath again. What do we do now? We see if the witch was right. You know, Mother said the Giants used to visit the Midgard Mountains before they disappeared. Disappeared? Yeah, I guess they just up and left one day. No one knows why. Perhaps they returned to their home. Jotunheim? Maybe. I wonder if the face in the mountain was a tribute to some important giant. The Mel! We made it! More black breath. stories of a giant with a deer. wonder who he is. No way across. But there's a sand bowl. What does it say? No yoked beast, nor fearful thrall, nor rooted tree, doth know my call. Hmm. done here. The 
the floor boy. That doesn't mean anything. I don't miss it. Think there's a second light crystal around here? Nothing. How do you think that got up there? This place must have been important to the giants. It's like they're testing us. Is it the answer? Freedom. Sure, that works. Go ahead. Sure. Rouse. What you doing? Oh, thought maybe there'd be a bridge. Huh. Your giants need to test us further. There's a crystal in that torch holder. Should I light it? That helps, right? <laughs> Guess we have to go down and go up. These passages seem too small for giants. <laughs> Why do you laugh? Oh, you're serious. I am always serious. I forget. Mom always said you never took an interest in history. Giants are just a race, like elves and hold your phone. It doesn't mean they're big. What of the world serpent? Okay, in that case, giant also means big. But there's only one of them.
takes care of that. <laughs> 